County Medical Examiner today confirmed the man who was shot by Portland State University Police on Friday is 45 year old Jason Washington. He's a local man with a family and a longtime postal worker. Our Lisa Balick joins us with much more on him and that incident that happened. Lisa? Well, postal workers tell Coin6 Jason Washington was very well liked by his co workers and those on his route in downtown Portland. He has a lot of friends and family who want to know why he was killed. My name is Arthur Washington. As you probably know, Jason Washington is my little brother. The family of Jason Washington mourning the loss of a husband, a father of three, a grandfather. They joined a rally yesterday to protest the shooting and the arming of Portland State University police. I graduated from Portland State University and I'm disgusted. Point Six found out Washington worked for the U.S. Postal Service for the past 20 years, most recently as a letter carrier out of the main office downtown. He was also a union steward and trained new employees. He served three years active duty in the Navy and several years in the Reserve. He had a concealed weapon permit and was carrying a gun the night of the shooting. This afternoon, we spoke with a witness to that shooting who took video when a fight broke out by the cheerful tortoise early Friday morning. Kiera Smith says Washington was trying to pull another man away from the confrontation when he fell. She's not sure, though, if Washington had his gun on him or in his hand when he turned away from police. I think that it was other measures could have been taken, not lethal measures. I think pepper spray would have done the job just fine. I think a taser even would have done the job just fine. Smith and other witnesses tell us officers yelled, drop the gun, then started shooting. The Portland police are investigating the use of deadly force, but have not said whether Washington was shot in the back. His family and friends want answers. Now, I did speak briefly with his family today at their home, but they say they do not want to make any comments right now. Back to you. Yeah, this investigation playing out. Lisa, thank you.